Nine days and counting since a feeble and mentally challenged man of over the bridge Denry went missing. His sister, Nadege Augustine, who's also his carer, recounts the last time she saw her brother, Jean Claude Seely. My brother was last seen on Sunday, Mother's Day, by me. Um, he came home Sunday afternoon. I gave him his lunch. But when he came, he was really not looking good. He was looking as if he was sick. So I said to him, you're really looking sick. Why don't you stay at your home and rest yourself? Go and take a plate and come and take your food. He brought a pan, but the empty pan was carrying him. I took the pan, I put the food in the pan, and I told him, go out his home and eat. He said to me, sis, 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 I love you, anything for you. I tell him, you don't love me because you're not listening to me. Take the food and go out your home and sleep. He took the food and he went to his house, and that was the last time I saw him. Today is nine days. According to his sister, Jean-Claude Seely was given a grim prognosis by both the Owen King EU's hospital and the St. Jude Hospital. They both warned her to prepare for the worse. He is um, skinny. He's not that tall. He has big eyes. He has the left hand infirm due to his brain tumor. He had a surgery at seven years old at Jackson Memorial Hospital in Miami. He was given a period of time to leave or else he would be dead after two years. He's still alive, but they said that if he's going to be alive, he will not be normal as everybody else. Recently, both OKEU and St. Jude said that he's not going to live long anymore to prepare his stuff for him for any time. Despite a deep sense that something may have gone wrong with her brother, Augustine is not about to give up on him. She has secured the services of the Royal St. Lucia Police Force, which is mounting a search party on the morning of Tuesday, 23rd May. The police is going to assist me tomorrow with a search. Um, we're supposed to gather at the Denny Police Station for 9 o'clock. And persons who are willing to assist from the community are asked to be there for quarter to nine so the search can start at nine o'clock. The sister of the missing man is calling on anyone with knowledge of his whereabouts to contact her at 719-3433 or the Denry Police Station at 456-1492 or 456-1494. Stanley Lucien for the HS News Force.